Well, we are at Burton Green and this is the new road that's been put in and it finally turns out to be a single track. So we'll cross the road. Um, you can see the old bridge there where those barriers are. That's all going to be taken down. And uh, I think what they're doing over there now is uh, we can't see because we're not allowed near the bridge, but I may just go over there and have a little look through the fence to see what they are doing to give you an idea of what is happening here. This is all coming down. They put the temporary road in, this is coming down. They're going to put the tunnel through, then they'll go over the top. Now, they're doing what I thought they were going to do. Put in some more supports. And then they'll put the roof on and dig out underneath. This lot will all come down here. That'll be pulled down. Yeah, what they're doing is they're going to be putting in concrete bases. Like the ones this side that you can see. See some concrete pads then the roof will go on top of those and uh, let's have a look the other side we haven't been able to see uh, for ages now what uh, what it looks like this side and we can get a better view now paths both sides it's really posh isn't it so they've got a double path now oh my word look at this you can see that's where the tunnel's going. Wow! They've gone ahead on this from where we were. I'll lift the thing up over the top so you can see properly. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, I used to come over, but you couldn't see. Now this is just built up on a great big pile of rocks and stuff. And the other side is scaffolding, holding it all up. Look, see there's all this here and the scaffold in there, we'll take a look from the other end, is holding all this bit up here and my right shoelace is under, oh right, okay. I'll pause it a moment, as I was saying, there's the, um, the embankment that's been built up to, in, on which to put the road. But I'm amazed here that the um, they're actually getting the tunnel underway. Look at this. You can see now. Let's see if we can get. Yeah, look at that. You can see the tunnel coming here. And of course, once they've knocked this bridge down and filled back in over the top of it, quite simply, uh, they are going to knock this bit down. All going to take a bit of time. can see the ancient piles there look that were put in probably some years ago what a massive machine that is look at it now we'll look back and you can see now the scaffold in look it's holding this road up Massive, massive. Oh, that's the bridge that is all coming down over there. That's all coming down. And uh, we can't easily see what's going on, but uh, he's putting in the concrete pads on which to put the roof. is over there yeah lots going on yeah so there we are he's doing that and this is the bridge that's coming down let's have a look through here that will all be gone so we're looking at the last days really of this dear old bridge. Don't know how long it's been there, but a long while. And now it will be gone. So, yes, we've got footpaths both sides on this. 
and uh, that's going out into the countryside that massive great uh, machine is amazing this is interesting somebody's here wonderful performance oh yes just look at all that being held up by this um, held up by the um, scaffolding have a look at it but uh, yeah just one little tunnel over there and it's all coming down Yeah, you can see where that's uh, where that's going to come through there. And so here we are. This is Burton Green, and uh, well, I've given you a little bit of a look around here, and it's all coming clear what is going on. Um, that seems to be doing a grand job over there. Um, I never worked out why they've done a concrete path one side and bitumen the other side, but. Uh, there we are. It'll be amazing to watch them then kind of pull all this down again. But I've got a few, an idea that it's going to be a good few weeks, if not months, before they pull that bridge down because they've got a lot of work to do over that side there to put down some more uh, concrete pads on which to rest the roof before they uh, dig out from underneath. see very well from here but it is better than nothing so we'll have a final look here at what is going on there we are that's putting in the concrete pads you can see them this side look already in and they've got to take some more of that bank down but I think it's supporting that side of the bridge so they haven't taken it down yet, but they're going to be taking it down. And then they'll put some more of those pads in a line over that 